have the uh, ministry machine, the Evangelistic Association, as Brother Eric uh, told you. Uh, and you know, all that amounts to is just, it's just something that, uh, uh, a coordinated effort, maybe. And a lot of times I, I'm the coordinator in the Army, but it's just a coordinated effort to share the gospel. Wherever and whatever, and you know, I'm going to say this right off the bat. When I come to a City Union Mission, I've said this since I've been coming for the last two or three years. I don't, I don't just come here to, to preach you, preach to you, or or just to uh, let you hear what I know, or you know, whatever. But I come here to recruit evangelists, people who are sharing their faith, people who want to. Who have the love of Jesus in their heart and want to, want to see other people with that same hope and that same love and to see this world change. How I many want to see the world change? Well, I'll tell you the only way this world is going to change is through the hand of Jesus Christ by the Holy Spirit. We have witnessed uh, leaders and politicians and you know, governments cannot change the world for the good, necessarily. Glad we've got them sometimes, but, uh, you know, some things are helpful. But we're here as a representative of Jesus Christ. And it's all, you know, all of us. So the thing that I really uh, kind of want to drive home a lot is that if you're a Christian... If you've asked the Lord Jesus Christ to save you, to, to if you've asked to come into his life, I know we've said over the years, that, oh, I asked Jesus to come into my life, and that, that's, that's fine, I, you know, I, I did that too. But I, I just came to the realization that well, I need to be in his life. And then he will be in my life. It'll, there'll be a, a role reversal. I, I really don't want to be in the driver's seat necessarily. I want him to lead me, guide me. And that comes to the point of the uh, message today. I brought about a uh, uh, influential, I guess you could say, a, a fella from what we gather from Scripture. Um, he has some uh, power, some means, some authority, and, and some uh, 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 monetary... Uh, he has some... Uh, monetary gains behind me. They, they call him, they refer to him as the rich young ruler. And it, it doesn't, all, I don't know, ever exactly says that's what he is, but throughout the context you realize he's young and he's rich and he's, he, he's, he's, he's got some authority in places. He's got some, you know, he, he swings a big stick anyway. Uh... You know, as Jesus is going around, and it's in, we're going to be in, in Luke chapter 18, if you have a Bible. Luke chapter 18. And 